Jamie. Welcome to Yeti Snow MX. And today we're going to talk about the highlights of last season. Last winter, we got a ton of feedback from snow bike enthusiasts. Guys were out riding our products, testing our products, guys were beating our products, all those things that guys do. And it was wonderful to meet those people, many different rides. It was wonderful to have them call us, give us their feedback. And we made some great new friendships last winter. Out of all the new relationships we built last winter, a few of them were, uh, became special friends and, and are professional riders for a living. And one that comes to mind right away was uh, Bill Elliott of NASCAR fame. Bill phoned me in his southern drawl. Some of Jamie, we really want to come up and ride in the snow. And uh, Bill has a place in Colorado, loves riding, and flew up to see us. And we had a great weekend with Bill and Jimmy Westway, guys from Georgia, and wonderful, wonderful guys and great riders also. Can't beat also, uh, last winter, the very first snow platform backflip, snow bike backflip in the world. Brett Turcott came up with the Monster Energy guys, did the first backflip on a Yeti, on his Kawasaki, and uh, Brett's looking forward to doing many more tricks with us and many more things next winter. Had a great time with him. Third, we met uh, Corey Durpak. Corey's been out riding. Good guy, some good contacts in, in Whistler area and working with Husqvarna. And uh, we look forward to more great tricks coming from Corey. And last but not least, I mean, Robbie Madison came up. His first time ever riding a snow platform. Rode the Eddy, took him out to Revelstoke with his family and Johnny Bro, it was awesome. So look forward to working. Next winter is going to be a blast. So the results from last winter, all that riding and meeting all these wonderful new people, was we got a lot of enthusiasm going on the Yeti Snowmax platform across two different continents and lots of different riders of different lengths, different bikes, different styles. It was awesome. And that's actually led, led us to expanding and growing our dealer network into the United States this year and building more Yetis. And as we sit here in June, we're ramping up. Kevin's still out riding Yetis and we're ramping up to build more for this winter. By the way, behind me is one of our test bikes. It's a 2015 KTM 450 that we've had for a couple winters now. And it's got a, we did a Kirill rod billet crank 104 millimeter big bore. It's a 577cc bike now. It makes a ton of power. We use that. And it happened to be the one that uh, we rode with Robbie when we went out riding. So it was awesome. Good bike. And we want to beat everything as hard as we can to make sure the Eddie's strong. Last winter was great. We got a ton of feedback from you, our customers. And through all that feedback, through all the communication and riding with you and experiencing all these things, we learned a lot about our product. And we took those learnings from you, the key takeaways, and we looked at how could we make our product better? How could we address these little issues? And thank God we had no major ones. It was just a great winter of learning little things and tweaking little items. So a couple four basic ones that we wanted to look at. One was our belt deflector. We experienced it made in the wrong plastic, a couple things we tweaked from there. Number two was when the belt deflector failed we had some belts break because once the housing's gone, the belts exposed, it can hit rocks and things like that. Three, we've seen a few shock shafts fail, lower shock suspension shafts, big drops, maybe big guys beating it on the trail, whatever it is. We want the Eddie to survive in all conditions. It needs to be the strongest thing on the marketplace, so we're aware of that. And number four is uh, there was a lot of myths last year. People, myths about the carbon cracking and things like that, rumors and things like that. So we're going to go through that later and talk about those things. Through all that riding last winter, we tweaked those parts and made them better. Gone through them to the nth degree, what you'd expect from us. And those new parts will all be on the 2017 Yeti. But what we realized is thanks to our customers who bought this year and that we got to ride with and meet, we had to come up with something called a customer appreciation upgrade. And what that is, is that's all the things we've tweaked and offered to you, our existing customers, at a very special price that only you can get with a serial numbered Yeti. In order to participate in this program, you need to go to our website at www.
yetisnowmx.ca and register your Yeti with us. And just for registering, all the customers with who purchased their Yetis last year will get an extra year of warranty until March of 2017. So it's really important. This is a, this is a big offer. We dug really deep to help look after our customers who stepped up. We're here to help you out. We're here to ride with you and have a good time. So thank you.